Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever, I guess we can call this the Madman Rumble. We have 30 random superstars, and I'm not talking about the WWE stars. We have 30 random participants who are going to come down to this ring and try to be the last person standing. And they ain't going to WrestleMania, but we can probably give them a cookie or something. I don't know. We uh, for started, we had, uh, I downloaded a bunch of people from the community creations. I just held down and left and right and whatever and just randomly selected 30 of them. I have no idea who's going to be coming out. I don't, I didn't select anybody. I did not play it. I did not select any entrance numbers. As soon as our ring announcer stops pantomiming what the rules are going to be for the audience, here we are. We're going to get our first entrant into the Batman Rumble. And I don't know who this is. Oh my god, now I know who it is. Ladies and gentlemen, this man right here that you see before you. The late 80s, about, I want to say the 80s or the ni uh, early 90s. This man, the revolting blob, he killed another professional wrestler. I... All I know is that he he was supposed to uh, he was supposed to let the guy out when he pinched his leg or something, but he never apparently felt the signal. He ran out of auction beforehand. Watch Billy Madison. Just watch Billy Madison. <laughs> I haven't watched that movie in years. I gotta watch it again though. It's funny. But that is the result of uh, from that movie too. Go figure. But that's our number one entry. Who will be number two? Will it be anybody as crazy as him? I don't know. I really don't know. Got new stuff. Ali song going playing right now. This is an Ali, is it? Oh my God. Ladies and gentlemen, it is Goku. This is just crazy. I, I don't even know where to begin. I don't know if his pyro knew where to begin with either, but <laughs> go break entrance. I I didn't make him. Somebody else. I did not make anything as good as that. That is phenomenally done by whoever created this guy. I can't look it up right now, obviously, because we're in the match. But ladies and gentlemen, Goku is your number two entrant here at the Madman Rumble. Oh, more pyro. There's a couple more questions. Number one, who's going to be number three through 30? Who's going to win it? And the bell has sounded. Well, the blob dodges a punch and goes right after the uh, Super Saiyan. Yeah, no, I don't follow I don't follow Dragon Ball Z, unfortunately. I know of Goku and all of them, but... If I call him a Super Saiyan and I'm wrong and you yell at me in the comments, don't. The revolting blob is just going right at Goku right now. We're already having our, our third entrant. Arm trap suplex. And possibly to help out the revolting blob it is Happy Gilmore. Happy Gilmore out there wearing his best jersey. He just came from the golf. He just came from the Waterbury Open. And goes spinning solo. And it looks like they're not going to team up. Comes flying at him. Like he just made fun of his putting style. And we already got number four coming to the ring. <laughs> R.I.P. Wee. That is all I'm going to say. I was I I'm a the I'm a huge Kiwi Herman fan, so I'm happy to see him in the Rumble tonight, ladies and gentlemen. 
as he hit a devastating power bomb to the Vivaldi Blob of all people. Very happy to see Petey here tonight. As I thought he was going to break the arm of Goku. He probably could too. The Vivaldi Blob's over the top, but he could not stay out for long. And number five, everybody say it with me. I'm a dude. You're a dude. She's a dude. Because we're all dudes. Hey, I'm a dude. I know, I fucked up on the, on the words. I can't remember everything. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. He was just got hit with a reverse scoop slam and a stomp right to the face. Ed from Good Burger is in the ring. And he is immediately getting his ass kicked by Goku. Oh my god, what is... The blob! Oh my god, he just killed Pee Wee again. And somebody the same size as Revolting Blob is coming in right now. It is Bowser. And Bowser can't do shit, apparently. Except for probably fart on, on um, Ed to get him off of him. A spear by Pee Wee on the Goku. Ed is taking it to Bowser. Oh boy, you pissed him off. Gonna get him a buy somehow. Number seven is the cap is the good captain. I'm not talking about Morgan. It is Jack Sparrow, ladies and gentlemen. It looks like Morgan's gonna go straight after after um uh, having Gilmore and try to eliminate him. Goku is over the top. Goku is not going out yet. He is not going down without a fight. All seven men are still in the ring. We're waiting on number eight. Throw me a shirt in the crowd. Ironically, I've seen the same spot years ago when I caught John Cena's shirt. As as Tyrone Biggums is on his way to the ring. And Tyrone's immediately... Are you kidding me? We couldn't see it happen. You gotta be joking! <laughs> Tyrone walked in the ring. I think he saw one of the other competitors and said, "Nope," and jumped right out. That's gotta be tied for Santino Morello's quickest elimination ever. And Pee Wee's over the top. Pee Wee, please hold on. Pee Wee's still in. Oh, clubbing blow to Happy Gilmore by Pee Kermit. Oh, what a knee drop. And our next entrant, Spring Bonnie, number nine. From the Five Nights at Freddy's Universe. And a good theme song to go with it, too. Hashtag Dexter Loomis. Pee with a whoopee cushion. Don't know why, but we did it. And maybe I just answered my own question. And Spring Bonnie's going right after Bowser. I just realized if I turned my tablet off and the Bruins game was still on. Shit. Oh, uh, the captain's got Pee You better put him down. I'm not. And don't you dare put him down outside the ring. What did I just say, Jack Sparrow? No, Pee survives and he falls back in. Oh, nice dodging on the punch. Oh, but it doesn't get away from the, uh, the swing side effect. We got eight men in one elimination. Tyrone Biggins, I'm pretty sure fastest elimination ever. Oh, a spinning side effect by Goku on the Happy Gilmore this time. Two, oh, a huge kick of Spring Bonnie. I don't even know what to call him. I don't even know what to call him without... I, I still can't get Tyrone's elimination out of my head. That was just... I, I don't even know where to begin. A Torpedo Moscow by Captain Jack. And Ed has been eliminated. I went for the Superman punch, but it's blocked. Off the ropes. Oh! Meeting in the middle. Botchamania. Uh, 
half and half overhead. Goku looking, uh, trying to stay, uh, trying to stay in. The old mobs trying to eliminate him. And the other, in the opposite corner, Bowser's trying to eliminate Happy Gilmore. I think he's going to do it. Yes, he does. Damn it. At least he has the green jack, or the gold jack to fall back on. After being shooting the Gavin. Kiwi just dropped across the top rope. Now Morgan's trying to make the uh, Morgan, wow, I, I must want alcohol. And I hear the sounds of real American, but I don't know about that. Here comes the former president, Donald Trump. Bruins score. Just finally got my tattoo back. I'm sorry. Bruins score. It's a 62 game in Philly right now. Don Trump's trying to eliminate Goku. Can't do it. We're going to get our next one. Kiwi. No, 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 no. Kiwi. Kiwi eliminated, but the Kevin Jack thinks it. Uh, he pays the favor by eliminating Spring Bonnie. As Ace Ventura has entered the chat. Now Bowser has Goku up and a huge Dead of Power Slam. Now spinning discus punch. No, I don't know what. Oh, Bulldog by Trump, but he gets kicked by the Golden Blob, and well, that was it for that, I guess. Maybe we'll get our next entry. Ladies and gentlemen, for the Mortal Kombat series, it is Scorpion. Sorry, I remember. I try to goodbye, Scorpion. That was quick. Tell Sub Zero we said hi. This Royal Rumble was just relentless, ladies and gentlemen. And we're about to get our next century. Hopefully, the last. Oh, God damn. I was going to say, hopefully, the last song, but it's current President Joe Biden. Who just hit a spear on Goku as former President Trump gets a uh, drop of the Gorilla Press? I think Trump wanted to go after, uh, uh, go after Biden because this time it's legal to punch him and vice versa. Chopped him at Ace Ventura. Oh my god! Biden with the springboard clothesline takes down Trump. Not the first time in the last four years that's happened. And now both, he is half man, half dog. He's his own best friend. Hits the spinning scoop slam onto Biden. And Goku just power bombed Ace Ventura over the top. We have an elimination. Goku's now trying to make a two for two. He's trying to go after uh, Jack Sparrow. Now, can he get the, uh, the captain over? As number 13, excuse me, 13. Number 15 is Eric Cartman. And Trump's trying to, Trump is trying to eliminate Joe Biden. Oh my God, Trump. Trump has eliminated Joe Biden. I was really, I was so paying attention to that. I didn't see who between Bowser and Cartman threw out Barf. I don't even know what to say. 
Maybe he feels better now. Probably not. Maybe he's still trying to look for 45,000 votes in Pennsylvania or somewhere. Double choke slam onto Jack Sparrow. And we're about to have another entry in three seconds. Welcome to Strength of Bowser. Deadlift that deadlifting Goku and sends him down to the mat. Yes! Eric Carmen couldn't eliminate Trump as Goldar from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers is, ma is making his appearance in the Rumble now. As some car would sound like it needs a new, new muffler and just went right by my place. Alabama Slam! In three seconds, we're gonna get another entrant. And if you thought you couldn't decide between Trump or Biden, Here's your third option. It is Al Bundy, the real, true, last American hero. And don't you dare Eric Hartman. We just saw and Trump just hit a stunner on a Goku. Oh. There's not much going on in the ring right now, except for Trump just getting clotheslined by Bowser. Never thought I'd cheer for B Bowser once in my life. As Trevor Phillips makes his, uh, his debut in the Rumble at number 18. So I'm still upset Petey got eliminated. Yeah, I was the biggest Petey Herman fan as a kid. You know, that's outside of his time for I was... I, I was born just before the uh, shit hit the fan for him. Oh, what a kick by Trevor knocks down Bundy. And a record lariat for Rainmaker. Now, can he get out? Can he get out Golda? Bundy's outside, he's back in. Is Goku gonna go? No, Goku's not gonna go either. Trump is up. Trump is down. What a slam by Cartman. What the hell was that? Did, did, did Jack, Captain Jack just, Captain Jack Sparrow just, uh, use the, use the poison mist? He's, oh, he's out by Cartman. Because the mist went off, and now, and Bowser's dead, I think. Phillips with the takedown of Goku. And Bundy, what a right hand. Oh, Chicago, dirty fighting right there. As the Bruins win, thank you very much. Nice little W before the, uh, before the, uh, all-star break. And Goldar, Goldar with a power bump into, oh my, that was beautifully done, into the, um, the Samoan drop. Phillips is trying to get Cartman out again. That's a big beefy boy. That's a you will not get him out that easily. What a power bomb! And yet another entry will be coming out in seven seconds. What a huge kick by Phillips on the Trump. And I don't even know what to say, ladies and gentlemen, except it is Dr. John Zoyberg. He immediately gets knocked. Oh! There was a couple of motions that went on the back of Cartman and Bowser are both out. I was so focused on, on Zoyberg coming in, I completely missed that. Bundy though take it. Oh my god, a knee. Bundy drops Trump and then Phillips drops Bundy. Now into the corner now in opposite corners. Goku's trying to eliminate the former disgraced president. Trevor is trying to eliminate Bundy. And I think Bundy's gonna oh, gotta go. And unfortunately Trump is still in.
And Trump is saying, screw this now. He's going to grab Goku. Who is the second into any power on here on the top rope? One. Number 20, Jason Voorhees. Jason Voorhees has entered the match. I'm pretty sure that's the, uh, I, was, I think that's the Jason you get if you, if you, uh, contribute to the, uh, campaign to, uh, for the, uh, creators of, uh, Friday the 13th of the game. Which is now basically dead. Pun, no, no pun intended. But, um, as soon as I can finish butchering enough sentence, our next entry is on our way out. As Goldar has hit my, oh! Jason is eliminated already as number 21 Batman makes his way to the ring. I'm just... It's just pure insanity, ladies and gentlemen. I don't understand what's going on in this match anymore. Batman with a huge drop kick to Goldar. And immediately goes right after... Oh, I think it was looking for a small package driver. Fisherman suplex, but he gets met with the Northern Lights suplex. Oh, and a pop-up knee strike and a kick to the head. And now he's going to go right after the doctor. Just pull up. And somebody will fight off the goal, fight off Goldar. It is the Red Ranger. The Mighty Morphin Ranger. And Phillips, though, instead is going to go after Goldar as the Red Ranger is going to get attacked by Zo Zoiberg. It's just so insane. It's just so insane, ladies and gentlemen. Now, Phil to the kick. And a spin, two kicks, a spin kick. Ladies and gentlemen, number 23. Get the vodka. It's the machine! What a knee strike by Phillips into the corner. And Burt Kreischer is already down in the corner. Oh, my nose is bottom is still. I'm so sorry, ladies and gentlemen, you have to hear that. Snap suplex by Batman onto, well, the ex-president. And Red Ranger with a beautiful backflip into a German suplex. Number 24 is... It is Ghostface. Oh, the Red Ranger is just beating Tina's arch rival. The Red, oh my god, Batman has just eliminated the Red Ranger. I thought you guys were on the same side of law. And Kreischer just gets kicked in the back of the head. Trump is over. Trump is eliminated by Goldar. This is the only time I can actually cheer for Goldar, I think. Some guy, I don't think knows what hits him. Look on, he's holding back, he's just holding back his head. I don't think you know what hit him. Well, guess what? It was a big man named Goldar. Now Zoidberg's taking it to Burt Kreischer. Phillips has, oh, I was going to say Phillips has Batman in the armor, but Batman beautiful, beautifully counters that out. And now, Burt Kreischer over the top. Zoidberg is only in the, the, the uh, comic, unfortunately. As Arthur Crowe makes an appearance and gets immediately kicked in the face by Ghostface. And now it's Batman going to hold on. Ghostface is trying to eliminate the Batman. He is over the top. What is going to happen? Is he going to go? Is he going to go? Is he going to hold it on? Goldar's helping him. No, he's going to fight it off. Zoidberg is sleeping in the corner. Trevor's trying to eliminate Art. Zorba just woke it up and gets hit with a brain buster. As number 26, the other face is making, is making their way to the ring. From the Texas Chainsaw series. Leatherface has made an appearance and immediately gets kicked down by Trevor. But pops right back up. This guy has some like supernatural strength. Almost like almost like Kane and Jason and Freddy combined. You think you can run away from him, but no surprise, he's in your back sleeve with a chainsaw. And Phillips and Bush is going to try to take out Leatherface. Oh, 
Cole and Phillips continue with uh, Chokeslam as number 27. The number to produce the most winners, Spider-Man. He is here. And Zoidberg just hit the stroke on Batman. This is so much going on. We got three more people to come out. I don't know who's going to be, I don't know who's coming out at all. Like I said, I held, I just held down and I just kept hitting X. Until we got 30 people. What a stomp kick. Oh, what a super kick. A stomp kick by Art and then gets nearly kicked in the face. Spider-Man now just teeing off. Leg sweep on the Phillips. Art the Clown. All oh, with a KO. Ushigoroshi to uh, Leatherface and now Art the Clown. Zorba's trying to eliminate the Clown now. Can he do it? I'm not going to hit. I don't think so. No, he's not. It's hard to tell what everybody's doing right now. There's so much action going on. And we got DC versus Marvel in, in the middle of the ring. Batman just dropped uh, Spider-Man with a, with a good shot to the head. And there's another one. Trying to eliminate Phillips. When Phillips ain't going down fight or I'll fight. You really think Trevor's gonna get knocked out like that? Look, 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 look this man is, is a psycho. He took out a bunch of men after trying to, uh, after being in fake cocaine. You really think he's gonna go out that easy? No. It's funny what's up. Batman, Batman, oh my god! Batman eliminated Spider Man. And Trevor immediately eliminated Batman. And now Trevor's gonna say, You're welcome. Oh! And Batman moved out of the way before Trevor can hit him. Three eliminations in literally less than 20 seconds. And what a lariat! Goldar hit the discus lariat and took Art the Clown's head almost completely off. Leatherface throws him over the throws ghost face over the top rope. I don't know if he's gonna, is he gonna be able to do it. He's got him, he is over the top rope, half the battle's over, but both those feet have to hit the floor. I don't know if he's, oh, he's gonna get back in. Number 28 is 50 set. I don't know why I don't hear any music going on. Like, it's, it's very quiet in here, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know why. And, oh, he had him in the in the Cobra Clutch. It looks like Art reverses, but no. He's got him again in the Cobra. Oh! He kicked him square below the belt. Number 29 is Miss Stoutfire. Art the Clown has just eliminated Leatherface. Mrs. Stoutfire, this sweet old lady. I don't know why. I don't know why this sweet old lady would want to come to the Rumble. Mrs. Doubtfire is just chilling in the corner. In the, oh my God! What a hit! Number 30 is on her way out right now. And two, one. Hit his Luigi, ladies and gentlemen. Number 30 is Luigi. All 30 men have entered this ring. Well, 30 men and one more, but the Mrs. Doubtfire. Yeah. Wink, wink. Or, you know, one woman, wink, wink. But, what a bold job by Mrs. Doubtfire. And now, Whisper in the Wind. Roller has him. What a full Nelson slam! Now Fiddy's got Luigi up. He drops him right face first across the top turnbuckle. What a drop kick by Mrs. Dow Fire. 
as it looked like Goldar hit. Oh, there went Zoidberg over the top. We are now down to only six participants. Let's make that five. Luigi is gone. The number 30 entrant is out. Who will be the last one standing in this match? Art the Clown is gone by Goldar. We're down to four. Ghostface, Goldar, Mrs. Doubtfire, 50 Cent. Who will win the first ever Mad Man Rumble? Who will earn the cookie? Ghostface, good luck trying to get that big man over the top by yourself. Oh, he is teetering now. Goldar is teetering on the over the rope. This will alley to herself. What a right. Mrs. Doubtfire up. And down with the Falcon Arrow. Goldar though. Goldar has a limited ghost face. We are down to three. And now we have an attitude adjustment. Oh, I think I don't know what Fiddy was going for, but Goldar was able to fight him off. And what an uppercut! A gorilla press uppercut. Buckets drop hit from behind. Can, uh, Mrs. Bell. Is Mrs. Doubtfire going to be able to do it? No, she can't. Maybe she could. Pump kick. And a DDT to Fitty. I'm in the octopus hole right now. Oh, yeah. The abdominal stretch right now. Excuse me. Goldar's just watching. Oh, a hip toss by Fiddy. Yeah. Why you gotta do this, that old lady? I think he just slapped a bitch. Oh, form to the back. Now Goldar. Goldar and Fiddy's... Goldar and Fiddy Center got team up on this defenseless woman. That was disgraceful. Now 50 with the short arm clotheslines. We still gotta get the big guy over the top rope. Oh, what a clothesline. And an elbow to the back. Mrs. Doubtfire is not playing any games here tonight. But gets dropped. What a lariat. Good Lord. I don't know how Mrs. Doubtfire is still standing, but she's got 50 on the ropes. Kid, he's in, is he going to go over? Is 50 Cent? No, 50 Cent's going to be able to hold on, punch the right in the face. And, oh! Like a zigzag almost. And then choke slam. Goldar is like powering up right now. This monster of a man. Oh, monster of a monster. He's got him locked. What is he gonna do with this guy? He's just gonna choke him? And this is that far step back, like, oh I'm not dealing with that. <laughs> this is fine. Oh, Punch the guy, it's fine, you gotta choke him out, but you still gotta get him on top of him in the stroke. And now Fiddy. No, DDT! Misses that far reverse. In the drop kick to Goldar. Misses that far needs to get. Oh! What a kick. Mrs. that far has to get these two guys over the top of Get him out. Let's get to bed with a headbutt by Finny Set. Now what's it? Oh, double right hands. Oh, there goes, there goes Finny. Finny's eliminated. We're down to two. And a 
one knee strike into the corner. There's the lariat. There's the discus lariat. All the lariat has to do now is pick up that fire and throw her out. It's some dirty boxing though. Just to be a show off. Now Goldar wasting no time now. Mrs. Doubtfire is up and out. Goldar has won the Man Man Rumble and has earned the cookie. This place is deafening. Ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoy, enjoy this match, please hit that subscribe button. We'll probably try to do this again some point in the future. Until then, Goldar, your winner. Enjoy the Royal Rumble tonight on the on Peacock and Pay-Per-View. Free ad advertisement for the WWE. Good night, everybody.